YouTube, what's going on? Team Svav here. Today I'm going to be starting a new series right here. Uh, it's going to be how to make a paracord bracelet. Um, today, or this series is going to be just a single color, and then I'll make another series on how to do the two tone. And I can also show you how. I can. Sorry, I'm. Hit all the way. I can also show show you how to either do the one with the buckle or one with just a uh, hook and loop, which is really easy. Nothing difficult because I didn't want anything difficult. This one I actually made for my neighbor who was being shipped off to deployed to Iraq, so I thought I'd send him a little gift. But um, this is the one that I currently wear every day. It's a two tone um, black and coyote tan here. Um, today we're just going to be using the black. I put it on this nice little swivel so it's nice and easy. This is going to be part one. I'm going to show you how to set everything up. And um, if you just give me a second, I'll be right back. It's just, uh, anyways, here we go. You're going to want to take off about um, I'd say, we'll do it this way, hopefully you can't, uh, see my head, but go, uh, arm's length across, alright, and, um, once you got that, Um, Alright, once you got that cut, you're going to notice that you have two ends that need to be burnt. Hold on, I already burnt these ends. So, what you're going to need to do, I suggest using your stove. It's the easiest way. And just, uh, so, you got your two frayed ends here. Um, sorry, hold on, I got a text message. Anyways, come over to your stove here. And, uh. Turn that on. I'll give you a second here. If you want to go ahead and cut your repair cord. And, uh, do it with the video here. I'll give you a second. Alright. I'm going to start now. What you're going to want to do, go ahead and fire up your, let's turn it on to a medium here. I'll zoom in. What you're going to want to do is take your end and just torch it up a little bit. And then it'll start to, uh, start to turn black at the end. It might start on fire a little bit, let it go blow on a little bit and under the other side. Make sure you don't touch anything with this because it is going to be gooey for a little bit. Go ahead and burn this end. Alright. Now, let me probably should have started off saying this, but this is how to make it uh, with the hook and loop. I don't have any buckles right now to make them with that, so make the hook and loops right now. I'll switch over to this side here. Go ahead and zoom in. Um, what you're going to want to do too is if you want to work with it right away, go ahead and set up your faucet. You want it just a little bit, like just drip a little bit, and just touch it. Touch it. And it will be cool to the um, touch here. So. You got your two ends now. To make the, this is going to be your paracord to make the design. Now you're going to need a, I'd say a one foot piece. Um, take off the one foot piece. Um, actually a little bit bigger than a one foot piece. Don't measure out exactly a foot. Guestimate. I'd say about nine inches. In it. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I'm drinking in Arizona. I'm just about to run out of time. So, 
hit me up on the next video, part two, watch it, we're going to continue. I'm going to upload this video, we'll keep the next one going.